Hey you guys and welcome back to episode 11 of Comedy Can't Communicate which yes already is the second to last episode of this absolutely adorable series so I'm really excited to see what they have planned for these last couple of episodes so if you guys want to watch more anime make sure to check out the link above that's in today's video in 3, 2, 1, go uh-huh Yeah, I thought it had to be. Come. <laughs> I mean, I knew it was going to be around. Um, come because what else does this class um discuss apart from everything that is our uh, goddess Come? But it looks like it is um school festival time, which is always exciting and also kind of a classic um along with like you know the sports festival to complete that kind of school um experience i feel like there's one more there's always a cultural festival there's always a sports festival what's the other one is it oh i guess like beach episode no but that's not like necessarily like a school classic i feel like there was another one. but anyways maybe um that's what they'll do for the season finale that's why maybe i think it's three because these last three episodes i feel like They've been doing kind of like all the traditional um kind of classic school stuff and it's really nice um seeing Komi enjoy all of those things i think that's the most important thing the fact that she's um been able to participate in all these kind of school events um and you can see herself that she's doing a lot of things she couldn't have maybe done in the um past as she kind of overcomes and oversteps her communication um Berries. Oh my god, I hope they actually do something really so sweet for the season finale between these two. But anyways, um, focusing on this episode. Uh, yeah, I do wonder what this class um, wants to do. Will they do a cat made cafe? I feel like that's a classic. And like, Komi is already a cat. Fair enough. We'll do everything. No. Yeah, sure. <laughs> uh, mm hmm. But that's right. Winter house. Uh... No, peoples, no, <laughs> not okay. Oh, yeah. But that might be a little bit of a problem. Where you want to get whacked by the goddess that is called me? <laughs> She's a genius. Yeah, but how does that involve Komi? Oh, and yes, true, an onigiri from. I feel like that's a lot. Oh, oh she has her own bed club. Ooh. Who the hell are you? That's true, that's true. <laughs> what is with you and sausage sucking? Oh, wow. Well, um, mm -hmm. Right back to square one. 
Can we ask what Kumi wants? No, 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 no. I'm sure Kumi has one she wants to do herself. And the goddess has decided. It shall be the cafe. <laughs> and that settled everything. Well done, Komi. Uniting everyone as one. <laughs> Kumi wants to help, but I don't feel like anyone would let Kumi lift a finger. Kumi's got you. Oh. Just sit on the th When did that, when did we? <laughs> oh, boss. I see. Yeah, I think it'll be better than her sitting on the god throne. She seems pretty normal in talking to the goddess. Oh yeah, that works, that works. Nice. No, 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 that doesn't work. <laughs> this couldn't. Oh, this is an interesting trio. I feel like she's the only one that works in like slow motion. <laughs> like everything else is going normal speed. Maybe splitting up is a bad idea. Yep. <laughs> Are we she's responding to the conversation before eh? she's quick to disappear why are you going to staff only She's very, um, it's like a cloud. She kind of has another form of communication. Hmm. 
Made me want to be your friend too. Oh, I'm sure Kami would love that. I always regretted it because I couldn't help. Mm. Oh! Thanks for listening. Oh my... Please don't tell me that works in stores. Oh, oh my lord. She, she is, she's like a chinchilla, but a slow one. I don't know how that works, but it works. Let's do our best. Dark for me. I think she sees like a side to Kami. Um that like others don't because she herself um communicates a little differently. That was nice, that was a nice little talk. Very direct, very fast. And, and you got free, oh my, oh my god, you, damn. Yeah, totally. <laughs> oh no. Could we eat and went out? Still works, still works. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Super effective. <gasps> oh, Coco, Coco. Yay! Go, go. <laughs> What's with the music with it? Oh, okay. Yeah, it sounded a little haunted. <gasps> Yay! The corpse is revived. <gasps> the limited amount of comi on the kitties. I'm going to go with the perfectly triangle ones.
Aha. One square and one diamond shape. Thought so. So your ones are the square? Thought so. Can we always make it small? Ooh. Okay, there's someone lying among them. Wait, no, the beautiful cubes are commies. Of course, Tarano knows. Well, not really, but it's just like his. Oh, <gasps> interesting. Damn. I don't get to eat a kumi or a kitty. I think she was thinking more of the traditional one. Oh, I'm not surprised. Oh no, she was shooting a video from a low angle. Cheeky, cheeky, very cheeky. What is going on? <laughs> right. No, they should have invited Kobayashi. School festival raid. Very cheerful. <gasps> These characters. Mm -hmm. But you have yet to meet. <gasps> she changed into the... Ooh. Is perfection. Yes. Oh, she was trying to say, excuse me. What, she went charmed by the goddess? That is Komi? A cudere. A whole new place. Come in, looks so goddamn good. Oh. 
Wait, it's time to win the... <gasps> Wait, the fuck? It looks... It's not... Yeah, it's not bad at all. It, it gives off Yamai vibes at the same time. No! Give it your all. Mama come here. <laughs> Is that what you think? Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> That was quick. That was very quick. <laughs> oh. That would be honest. <laughs> Beautiful. You look great. You look so cute. Oh, you... The two of them fell to bed. <laughs> the second part will continue into the next episode. Okay, so it looks like season finale still continues on with the cultural festival which i am really looking forward to but yeah as always a really adorable episodes i love the fact that we got to meet a couple of new characters it was quite a fast-paced episode with a lot of things going on as we get ready for this cultural festival i liked how we met someone else that had a different form of communication themselves i didn't quite catch their name but i loved how they were quite an interesting character at first and i didn't quite understand what was going on but i think it just really hit when they said that oh you know even if it takes you a while like it takes you a while to say something like you should still try to say something and that's when it kind of really clicked i was just like oh maybe you understand Komi on another kind of different level as well because you have a different form of communication yourself as we could see they were very fast like a ninja would disappear in an instant but at the same time i like to kind of respond to the conversation but it was really lovely how Komi did make a new friend and honestly i'm gonna say this episode Komi actually was saying a lot of words naturally and i would say that's quite a change because i think in the first kind of couple of episodes anytime Komi said something it was like a moment you could see with my anticipation be like oh, for like ages so this episode you could see like Komi trying to say a lot of things especially during the main cafe experience like we actually heard Komi say quite a few things this episode and it wasn't like a major build-up or anything because it seems a lot more like kind of natural of Komi's kind of like character progression and so I really liked how they went about that but yeah I guess with that only one episode left a woman oh goddess that is Komi so I can't wait to see what the season finale will bring so until then make sure you guys stay awesome and I'll definitely catch you guys then